Hi, we're the Tokyo Holics. In a little bit, one of our friends from high school is gonna come to this house to shoot the Tokyo Holics. What's gonna happen to her, Jean? Of course, she's excited to be in part of, part of the show and everything, but we're, we're gonna have more fun than her. <laughs> <laughs> so, what we're going to do is tell her we're shooting an episode which is fake. The theme of it will be like scary shit that happens in Japan. Yeah. We're gonna make us so much like false stories. Yeah. And then, without her realizing that the whole thing is a prank, we're gonna make each other laugh. Yeah. If I laugh, I drink. If he laughs, he drinks. She probably won't know, realize because the whole show is about drinking. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, how does she win? She wins so, if she, uh, she realizes that this whole thing is a joke and we're just like trying to, you know... Yeah. You know, you know, do what we always do. <laughs> <laughs> and whoever laughs the most has to drink an entire can. Has All to right. shotgun it. Dude, I haven't shotgunned since like last week. <laughs> <laughs> First stomach. The pressure like, is making June like have a stomach ache. No, not even the small intestine. It's just like stomach. stomach. <laughs> hey guys, we're Toga Alex. I'm Jin. I'm Ro. And this is Mew. Mew. Hi. <laughs> Today's topic is scary things around Japan, kind of myths and stuff like that. We're gonna name a few points to let you know what the heck is scary in Japan. Yeah, it, if it's summer now and then the hotter it gets, you're supposed to do like scary shit so that you know yeah. you get the chills, you know. So you're just supposed to cool you guys off. <laughs> cool you off. Okay. You ready? Yeah. So from this point on, okay? From point number one, got <laughs> Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm so confused about- okay! It's okay, we got it! Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna... So point number one is yokai. Now, yokai is kind of like a mythical... Creature. <laughs> Why is he laughing? Why is he laughing? I think he just wants to drink. Yeah. I'm scared. <laughs> Okay, so yokai is kind of like a mythical creature based on folk tales that spread around Japan, such as like Nurikabe, like yeah. Roku, Roku, Roku. Ah, oh, the like Roku. yokai with like the really long neck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's these stories that you tell, and these like kind of ghosts or myths or whatever it is. You teach your children these moral things. I don't know the story of that long neck woman, like, but. <laughs> no. So that story of that long neck woman is like. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just scared. I can't do it. Come on. So this yokai woman, like, is she from like Slytherin? <laughs> what? No, okay, so there must be like a story associated with it, right? Yeah. There's, what's, yeah. The, what's the moral of that story? So I, I'm not really sure about Okurokubi, but there's a thing called kappa, but they like a uh, cutie, which is like cucumbers. They sit in lakes. Uh, they have like a plate on their head that when it's broken, they die. That came up because back in the days when there was like a lot of onsen coming to release, people started mining a lot. And a lot of the time, old people... <laughs> it's like a lecture now. <laughs> that, that's what I was feeling too. And that's why it's just like you stop laughing. It's like, the it's more really... Your it's so just like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so basically when the onsen was getting popular, a lot of old people would uh, die in the onsen because they stayed in too long. Wait, basically that's why kappas are drawn to be so old. When the children would go to these onsens and see these dead old people, it's just a way to tell them like they have a lot of bacteria. So it's a moral thing to teach children not to go to onsens and touch old people that are staying. Because they, they, there is a chance that they, they could be dead. This got real <laughs> dark real fast. But aren't kappas on like two rivers? Well, Did like, you just make this whole thing up? No, I didn't, I didn't make this up. It, it's, the actual story is like, kids don't go to onsens because there are scary kappas there. Oh, it's it's like, onsens first were outside, right? And then it, they transferred it into an inside facility. But well, what about that story where like, there's like a legend that kappa asked for, asks people to s'more with them? S'more? S'more. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously thought you said s'more. Sorry. Sumo, oh sumo, <laughs> sumo with them. How about me? Like, I'm okay. I, mean, <laughs> I guess yoga is like 
too broad in Japan where like you don't really know stories about Japan. But there's Japan. also like I think it's really good difficult. yokai suit, right? Amobi? Yeah, it's, like, yeah. It's really popular in Japan though. Kind of looks like the shroom, kind of looks like a murami person. Okay. It's like this tradition that if you make that into a drawing, all diseases will be gone. So really? that's why it's like really popular now with the Corona virus going on, everyone's like drawing on my trying to be like, oh, we don't have the disease. <laughs> so, what's happened with the long ass <laughs> neck woman? So, we just talked about yokais, okay? Mm. Point number two is aliens. Actually, so like coming up uh, for the video, I read a lot of um, scientific papers just, just to like be like clear on what I'm saying. I believe aliens do exist. Yeah. Yeah, totally understand. Yeah, um, right now in CERN, like they're they're exploding like small particles close to the speed of light. Once they crash into each other, there's so much energy that it starts opening up other dimensions. Okay. Wow. Holy shit. And it's like, like Rick and Morty. And in um, <laughs> Rick and Morty. <laughs> it's like Rick and Morty though. Because, you know, unfortunately there were nuclear bombs in Japan. Because of that nuclear explosion, there has been like reconfirmed cases of this, uh, Looser ghost, like that's what they call it. It's called looser. Yeah. Because sometimes, um, because of the pressure differences, like the wind flows, and then you can kind of hear like looser. <laughs> <laughs> what is? <laughs> what the heck? Suddenly, no. Got really cheap. <laughs> <laughs> no. It was like a good story until like, <laughs> and then it suddenly got really cheap. <laughs> okay, my question is, so you know there's like UFOs, mm, yeah. but like, isn't any flying object that's like, un identify UFOs? So like, until you confirm what it is, isn't it all UFOs? Right. Yeah. So like, let's say I see an airplane and like, I wouldn't say it, but I'd be like, what is that? Would that be UFO? No. <laughs> it would be a UFO for you. Yeah. Yeah. Just for you though. Yeah. <laughs> No, no, really, like, yeah. look at there's yeah. a looser ghost. Mm. It's called looser ghost. Mm. You're just pulling that back <laughs> up right now, eh? Because it's in Rick and Morty. So. Yeah. What? Hello? So that's a reference to <laughs> <laughs> Rick and Morty is going to that paper, really. The next point. <laughs> Ghosts? Oh my god, oh my god. Dude, we filmed this whole thing with the AC on. Shit. Oh shit. I'm the AC guy now. Dude, I, I can't, I can't, I have to include this one. Hopefully it's not too bad. Fuck. We, we don't keep track of time. We should put on a timer or something. Okay, you're the timer guy now. Um, Give me my phone. So point number three is obake. Now, obake or like- Focus just, on the, focus on the- You said on the timer no, guy! No, that's for the next one. Like, not right now. Look at the camera, okay? <laughs> So point number three is obake. Obake is like a very specific word in Japan used to describe ghosts. Like in Japan you say obake or yurei or ghosto or something like that. Like they have a lot of call names like uh... <laughs> Don't stop there! <laughs> it's just like, <laughs> stop talking! <laughs> <laughs> and thought he thought that would finish his point by stopping. <laughs> don't say like go uh, when you don't have more examples. Everybody has some kind of scary experience with ghosts, right? Oh yeah. I used to go to the hospital a lot when I was a kid. Um I saw like this guy who he had like a injury in the um the, near the dump truck and then he got his skin all like messed up and then like he had like plastic on his skin why are you guys laughing he had plastic on his skin it was like you know like those iphone cases his forearm was like clear back iphone case it was all plastic and you can see the insides of his like underneath his skin like that's a ghost for me <laughs> I used to call him like the I don't know, plastic bottle alien. Pet bottle seijin. Were you just talking about the jiro handbike seijin or the. No, the pet bottle seijin. You guys keep on saying nantoka seijin. It literally is written like star person. And you guys are talking about aliens, not ghosts. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Focus, right, guys. Right, right. Focus. So. 
Yeah, I got impregnated by a ghost. And I have a baby growing like, inside my thigh right now. I, I got impregnated by a ghost too. Oh yeah? Where? I got a baby Same place. inside my thigh right now. Same place. <laughs> okay, well that was we, 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 we stuck to that. Am I supposed to say it too? I got impregnated. I guess thank you for watching. No, it wasn't thank you for watching. Cause this is actually a prank. <laughs> we feel so bad at it. It was a prank? <laughs> yeah, like they were just saying like bullshit things about uh, scary stuff. The whole time. To you. What? And, uh, until you tell us, oh shit, this is a joke. Yeah, but you, yeah. you thought that we were joking <laughs> yeah, with, the, with the camera. With the camera. Uh, you were joking too. Yeah, like, that's just... <laughs> I thought this was like your usual. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <laughs> we, we tell good good stuff. Yeah, but just then stories. We try to make you sort of laugh. Yeah. yeah. So I, I was thinking like this is a whole mess of YouTube channel. <laughs> So yeah, um, so that's why we were laughing so much. We're like yeah. giggling so much, right? Because if you laugh, you have to drink. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, but you guys are laughing all the time so, anyway. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. But I think he laughed more than I did. Yeah, I remember. Of course, I did a few big ones. Um, but, so he's got to drink the whole can. Yeah, it's great, it's great. I was great. like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, It was good, Shut up. I think half of my laughs came from the fact that you made me laugh. I know, I know, I know. I ate the I know, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> like falling down. I'm like, why are you laughing? Yeah. I'm so yeah. serious. So yeah, all that like so. extra <laughs> dimension shit. And then because he's like, he suddenly he's like, like Rick and Morty, right? And then so yeah. I couldn't start, like, I have to think of Rick and Morty like references. Looser Ghost. Yeah, you, you knew I was this gonna get it. Not that true. was not Looser Ghost, the whole it's just made up, okay? Yeah. <laughs> I love that scene. That's my favorite scene. You guys can all say that Mew is awesome. Uh, we're gonna shoot another video really quickly, but the proper one. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for watching. Please like. I'm not in house arrest. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment that Jean and Yo is cool, and see you in the next episode. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Dude, in kindergarten, I thought timeout was a joke, seriously. Because I'm like, from a Korean, what is it, like, pl place school? What do you call that? Like, before kindergarten. Preschool. Oh, I thought preschool. Pre college? <laughs> no, preschool, preschool, preschool. Daycare? Preschool. Daycare. Daycare. Yeah, daycare. Daycare. <laughs> Who the, go, who the fuck goes to <laughs> kindergarten after college? Some special people. That's totally chill.